If you're hung up on whether or not to go with a brown versus a gray polarized lens, I'm here to help, so stick around. Thank you so much for joining me. I am Eyeglass Tyler of SportRx. I'm an optician and here I am practicing social distancing, a phrase I think we will not soon forget. But it's cool because I get to invite you into my humble little hobble, right? And what I want to talk to you today about is brown versus gray polarized lenses. I want to help you figure out what will be right for your sunglasses in terms of the tint color and the topics I'm going to cover to delve into this subject is the overview of what to expect between those two colors. I wanna talk about which is best for sport application. It's important for us at SportRx. I wanna talk about which is best for driving because that's a good topic as well. I think most of us are gonna be using them for driving as well. I wanna talk about which is best for bright days because that's important for a sunglass frame and uh, ultimately just give you a, a good rundown on the, the comparison between the two lenses. So let's jump into it. Okay, so an overview of what to expect from the colors. A gray lens is probably the one that most of you are the most familiar with, and that's gonna be a good dark lens, and it's gonna be neutral in color perception. Things are gonna look true to real world color. With a brown lens, you're gonna get more contrast enhancement. It's going to help to make colors more vivid, make things seem a little brighter, make it a little easier to identify one thing from the other. Okay, so which color is best for sport application? I would say pretty much across the board, it is better to have contrast enhancement. That contrast enhancement helps with depth perception cues. It'll help to make it easier to spot and track things like potholes or better to read the terrain just because of the color enhancement and making it easier to differentiate one color from another just makes it pop that much better. So being able to see things in fishing in particular, since we're talking about polarized flats fishing, fly fishing, inshore fishing, where it's important to be able to see the fish, it's going to make the fish stand out a lot better because you can see the differences in color that much more easily. So I always recommend for sport applications, something contrast enhancing. And if you're debating between brown and gray, brown will be the one. So which lens color is best for driving? I think it's safe to presume that the majority of you do drive and you definitely want to make sure that you're protecting your eyes while you're in the car. The more protection you have against, you know, blinding glare and excess light while you're in the car can make it a safer experience for sure. And since we're talking about polarized, that also helps with cutting glare, bouncing off of other windshields and the asphalt and everything there. But what color should you go with? And what I would say is the most popular color that people go for with a driving pair is gray. I think they just tend to prefer that true to world color perception. But that being said, there is nothing wrong with brown. Brown is still going to give you that contrast enhancement. And like I said, it's going to make it easier to spot and track things like potholes. It can make it easier to read the terrain. Uh, but maybe for cosmetic reasons or whatever, some people tend to, most people anyway, tend to prefer the gray lens color. So not a black and white, right or wrong uh, answer here. It kind of is what works best for you. And so take that into consideration. So knowing those things, what is the best lens for bright light? Probably gray. It, it is a denser tint color, so it's going to absorb more light. Uh, what's interesting about this is you can get a gray lens and a brown lens that both reduce the same amount of light transmission. So the same amount of light is actually making it to your eyes, but people find that a brown lens makes things seem brighter, and that's because colors are more vivid. Colors are boosted, so it makes it seem like there's more light coming off of those objects. So that actually might be a benefit for some people if you don't want the darkest dark lens possible, you want something that's still gonna protect your eyes against excess light, but will allow more light to make it to your eyes, that's a great option, the brown. But the, for the most part, the darkest, densest tint that you can get is going to be a gray. And a little added special side note here, if you do a mirror coating on top of this, 
it's gonna help cut that much more light transmission because it reflects more light back, means less light is making it through the lens. So if you're looking for the absolute darkest of dark lens, gray with a good mirror coating is gonna be the ticket for you. Color comparison, brown versus gray. I pretty well covered it by explaining what each of them do, but just to summarize, what you're gonna get with a gray lens is a good dense tint that's really dark, neutral color perception, true to world color perception. With a brown lens, you're gonna get contrast enhancement. It's not gonna be true to world, it's gonna be boosted color perception, heightened differences between colors, it's also gonna make it easier to spot and track things like potholes. It's gonna make it easier to read the terrain because the depth perception cues are enhanced. So whether or not that's the right one for you is gonna be up to you. So that pretty well covers what I think you need to know if you're shopping for lenses and you're stuck on brown versus gray polarized lenses. Hopefully this information was helpful and after understanding a little better what to expect from those lens colors, uh, after knowing maybe it's important to you to know if it, it's what lens is better for sport application, knowing what lens color is better for driving and which is darker, and just the overall comparison was good information for you to decide what is right for your pair of sunglasses. By the way, if you decide to order from SportRx, Thanks to our See Better Guarantee, you're never gonna be stuck with something that you don't like. So if you find that after all this info, you still get the wrong lens color, if you order from SportRx, we're gonna make it right. Whatever that means for us, we're gonna make sure that you're happy ultimately. And if you need prescription, by the way, we have a lot of opticians who would just love to talk with you and help you through this process. Maybe I didn't cover everything that you wanted to know when ordering glasses for you. There are a lot of other features to consider and that's where our opticians come into play. And if you call us, we'll help you through that process and make it a lot more uh, simple and make you more confident that you're gonna get the right thing the first time. So definitely reach out to us. Thank you so much for joining me in my humble abode. If this was interesting or valuable, give it a thumbs up, why not? Also, check out relevant videos here. If you subscribe, you're gonna hear about those relevant videos first, by the way, I recommend that. Check us out on our social media outlets at SportRx. Thanks.